welcome to week one of our Falling Leaf Stitch Along. This week we will be doing these six right here, not the pink one, we'll come to that one later. One, two, three, four, five, six. These six, quote, leaves. I know some of them are berries, but these are the ones that we'll be doing this week. Uh, some things that you might want to be aware of. Um, this is cork fabric. It's got a backing on it that holds it together, um, and the cork is very is flexible, um, and I love the printed pattern on it. I think it goes really well with this project. Um, on this one, do not stitch down these little pink circles. They are cut at a quarter of an inch circles. Um, I used a die cut to do it, but you can hand cut them. But they are, they're only tacked down by the bead in the middle. So just tack them down with that bead. Don't stitch, don't applique those down. When I am um, stitching these lines or marking these lines to stitch them, I took my placement guide, which is printed on a vellum paper and laid it in the, the right place. And then I just poked through with a pencil periodically so that I would know where I needed to stitch those. So that's my suggestion for that one. The other one that I'll comment on is this one right here. Um, it says in the instructions that these are supposed to be open buttonhole stitch. Um, I did the back stitch to begin the open buttonhole stitch. You will have already back stitched around the leaf, but I did the back stitch down the middle and then started right here to do my open buttonhole stitch in each case. I think it's easier to start with that straight line and to work with a curved line. So I always started in the middle. Uh, this is usually when I'm sewing a chain stitch around the edge of a shape, I have it off the edge of the shape. But in this one, I wanted these bright colors to show. So this one, I moved it in just a little bit. And so instead of it being on the background, it is on the leaf. Okay, those are all the tips and tricks for week one. We'll see you next time in week two.